Hey guys, I'm squinting because it's like really bright where I am and I can't record anywhere else because everyone's home for some reason and decided to talk in all the areas that I usually record. So today we're going to do a video of me, me using my mama's makeup because fun fact, my mom doesn't really do makeup, my grandma doesn't do makeup, my family really does makeup besides me so I'm trying to figure where I got this makeup gene from. But first we're going to use this Beauty Bakery Make and Bake Oil drops on my face because my mom has like normal dry skin and so she likes radiant skin meanwhile I'm trying to figure out how to do radiant skin while staying not too matte at the same time so we're just gonna rub this in to really do full face of makeup unless she asked me to do her makeup and I don't know how she really does her makeup. I know she loves bright colors. She's like a very colorful person. And then like, you've seen her in my video, or like, you can look at my thumbnail of my giving mom a makeover video. Call, calling it a day. <laughs> like we're two completely different skin tones. So, she's light skin, I'm dark skin. So I'm just like, yo, no. I have my fan on because for some reason it's hot in this house. I don't know why. I understand it's winter, but don't make it too hot. <laughs> and so I'm gonna let this sink into my skin for a couple of minutes. But um, she uses powder brow eyebrow products, so I'm gonna do my eyes first for once. And then the rest of my face, we're gonna see how this goes. So luckily, we use the same eyebrow color. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills powder duo brow powder duo in the shade ebony I don't know when's the last time she used this so I'm just going to use the spoolie end of my next eyebrow pencil and use it to blend I really need to get my eyebrows done so I actually do not care about what my eyebrows look like I need to get them done Wait, there's a little mirror in here so I don't know how to do brow powder. I never really was interested in powder eyebrows because I'm like, don't they run off after a while? Like, what? But we're gonna try it today. <laughs> mm, I'm gonna grab the lighter side to um do the front of my eyebrow. Don't like this at all. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna figure it out and just wing it. <laughs> okay, so I'm grabbing my NYX brow pencil because I can't do the powder. Like, this eyebrow is way more bushy. Like, I have sparse, bushy eyebrows. Do you see this? Like, this one's way more bushy than this one. And it's pissing me off. So, <laughs> we're just gonna continue on with a brow pencil. Okay, so, uh, these are like the worst eyebrows I've ever done in my life, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm getting my eyebrows just soon anyway. I've been home for like a week, almost a week starting tomorrow, and I haven't gotten my eyebrows done. Isn't that something? And so now I'm just setting them with the Essence Make Me Brow um, Eyebrow Gel Mascara and Brownie Brows because if my mom knew about this, she probably would have used it. My mom's a really simple on the go type of girl, so. Yeah, that New York blood in her. I my eyes with my usual lately, the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion in the shade Original. I do actually use this on my mom. And lately I've noticed why have I not been using this on me. <laughs> so I've been using it a lot lately. And just blending that out with my finger. Grabbed a bunch of like random makeup my mom has. And she mainly has like Avon and MAC. That's what she mainly has in her collection. Avon for eyeshadows and MAC for like complexion. And so... I never use Avon eyeshadow products, so this one is the Q10 True Color Quad in Mocha Latte by Avon. And this is the one that she used a lot. Yeah, because she uses this one a lot, obviously. Um, then there's the Avon Q920 True Color Femme Fatale. This is like really pretty on the night out. This is my mom. This is really her, and she still has this stupid brush, which I know she uses, but we ain't gonna do that, like these things. I'm not using that. Um, what else does she have? She has this Avon 
True Color Q911 Caribbean Sunset Sunset Squad Quad. Wow, this is actually pretty, pretty, pretty colors. But there's no mat. You always need a mat. <laughs> so I'm gonna use a mix of this one and the True Color Mocha Latte to like have a transition color for once. This is really, this is old makeup. I know this is old. I'm going to use this shade because she completely finished this one. I don't know what that color was, but this shade. Oh. Okay. I'm going to use this shade here. And, um, so let's see how that goes on the crease. How is this blending? We don't know. You can't tell. It looks ashy on me. I don't really see it. Do you see it? I feel like my eyes just got even more browner and gray. I don't want gray. I want like a bright color. I'm just going to grab this shimmer and put it in the crease because that looks more brown than this one. The pigment is <sighs> oh. Do you even see it on me? Because I don't even see it to myself really. I feel like I'm putting gray on my eyes. I'm just going to grab this shade with the same brush because y'all and just see if that does something oh my god it really does it so we're just gonna grab this dark brown with this like spectrum big old fluffy brush because the top came off but it's fine and just pounce that into my outer crease pretty much my outer V of my eye all I see are shimmers in my eye <laughs> That's all I see. So I feel like putting orange on my lid and the blue underneath. Oh, we're gonna try to put the orange on with my finger. It's as bright as it's so chalky. And just put it on. And just dab it on. Dab dab dab. Oh crap. Fat finger lifestyle. It's not as vibrant as I thought it would be. It's pretty powdery, so I'm gonna put this on with the brush also. A08 brush, this type of brush, and just grab it again. Oh shoot! And I'm like doing my makeup, but also like what my mom will most likely do. Like she, I would actually put concealer underneath this and cut my crease, but she wouldn't, so we're not gonna do that. This is like makeup that's upsetting me and it's kind of pissing me off at the same time because it's pretty, pretty patchy and I've been telling her her makeup is patchy but she never listens to me and so we're just going to try to blend this all out. Now I'm going to do my base which is the Fenty Beauty Pearl Filter Soft Matte Longwear Foundation in the shade 440. My mom uses press powder. Do I have it? No I don't. Dang it. She uses like pressed powder foundation she doesn't really use liquid but when I'm doing her makeup I use liquid so we're just gonna do that I'm just gonna blend this out with my beauty blender okay <laughs> it's gonna be a bad makeup day and I'm fine with it uh, hopefully I don't go nowhere today but this is the ColourPop no filter concealer in the shade I don't know, Deep Golden 60, I believe, yeah. And I'm just gonna apply, like, how much do I put on her? I put hers on like this. So, we're just gonna do that. Oh God. It doesn't contour, so I'm just gonna blend it out like this. And so we're gonna set that concealer with the Laura Mercier Loose Translucent Powder. I look very, very, um, not my skin tone on camera, but I went into like the bathroom and like other rooms in this house and I actually do look fine. It's just the stupid sun. <laughs> and the sun's not even like directly on me, so it's weird. So knowing her, she will not bake because she is dry, normal skin. So I'm just going to set it like she would and keep it pushing. And she wouldn't contour, which is why I didn't contour. She was just bronze because she likes her face to be warm. And she loves being tanned, so we're just gonna go with that. 
Ah, she would not bake. <laughs> she really would not bake at all. She doesn't understand the premise of baking, period. So she does, she will not bake. To set the rest of my face, I'll be using my Max Studio Fix Press Powder, mine, because she's whiter than me, and just set the rest of my face with this. Not gonna be a good makeup day. We're gonna continue on with it. For bronzer, we'll be using the ColourPop Press Powder bronzer in the shade bits and pieces and call it a day. She will really bronze her face too. So I'm just gonna bronze bronze everywhere. Who's not liking the eyeshadow pods? Me. Why not? They're not for me. <laughs> the side of my nose, grab a different finger and blend it out. That's how she would do it. <laughs> blush but she wouldn't put on highlight but I think she does like highlights I don't know about that but we're gonna go back with the eyes and go back into this palette this is the right one no I should have done these colors these colors are actually really really pretty and so I'm actually gonna try to do something with it so I'm gonna grab the gold my good brush the Irma Decay brushes that come with the palette and grab the flatter side and grab the gold and put it on top of that orange it's not really as like super duper pigmented as I want it to be or shimmery but um, we're just gonna roll with it grab like the supposedly like blending side and blend it out it's a flat brush and then grab this green cause she would do that if she was a full face person. This is the um, Femme Fatale quad by Avon and put it underneath my eye. Not what I want it to be. If you're wondering why I'm using possibly expired makeup, because that's what she has. That's what I'm going to use. So I'm using what she gave me, and this is what she gave me. And by what she gave me, I looked through her makeup, and this is what I found. So off camera, I put some MAC Prep Prime Spray on my brush and grabbed the gold and tried to make it a little bit better. But as I'm thinking about this, this is kind of like Mardi Gras. Yellow, green, gold. And, I mean, green. <laughs> green, gold, and purple. But for a shocker, the purple is matte. So I'm trying to figure out what to do with the purple. And this is just not going as I intended it to be. But we're going to keep it pushing and just figure it out. So I'm just going to put this in the point because I lost that brush. Grab a bit of purple and put it on my outer V. I found my blending brush. And I'm grabbing this purple and putting it on my outer V. Yes, I'm going over everything and calling it a day. A bit, but this has like no pigment whatsoever at all like it turned gray what is with your stuff mom oh my god that's it um i'm gonna grab my mark jacobs highliner black eyeliner because she doesn't know how to use liquid eyeliner so we're just going to use this into my waterline and my mom uses like mainly affordable mascaras and mac so i have my mac sample mascara so i'm gonna use my maybelline colossal big shot mascara in black black Okay, so off camera, I put on, um, looks so done. I put on ColourPop Super Shock Cheek Pearlize and Most Set Necessary first. And then I put on Jackie Ina X Artist Couture for Le Bronze. And, um, I'm gonna put Le Bronze in my inner corner. My hand is all glittery uh, because this is what happened. I'm not really feeling this. Oh, this is the wrong highlight, too. It's upside down. That would have went left real quick. Um, grab some Le Bronze because Le Bronze Jackie Eye makes me feel better. And this is this is how I'm gonna do it with this loose highlighter palette and just highlight my inner corner and my eyes. And <laughs> for blush, this is the only blush I brought because I didn't think about doing this when I was back at school. I brought makeup that I usually use for my everyday and call it a day. So this is Shea Moisture 
middle spice, middle brush and spade. Wait, it always happens. Shea mix. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shea moisture. Mineral blush and spice. I was gonna grab some. She will grab like a really bright color knowing her. And I don't have a really bright color. And she doesn't have any blushes because I went in her makeup area again and she doesn't have any blushes. So I'm just like, what? <laughs> so we're just gonna use this. She likes radiant skin. So I'm just gonna use my Matte Prep and Prime Fix Plus spray as my setting spray instead of the slick. Because I don't even know this is like a good setting spray for me. I wish. I wish I was 21 so I can go to the bar and get a drink because I really don't like this. Um, so, uh, these are three lipsticks she got. She got like other ones but she doesn't know where they are because they're usually either in her purse or at the most random areas in general. So we're just going to look at what she got. It's too late. You ain't doing that. No, no, no. Um... It's like a brown. This is pretty. I would actually wear this. Certainness. How long did she have it? Um. Ooh, absolutely not. Not, not what we're about to do. So, uh, most we're gonna go with this lipstick. This is the Avon, of course. Another Avon product. Avon Ultra Color Rich U250 Cherry Jubilee. <laughs> I'm screaming these. This and call it a day. It's a mirror. I'm not feeling this at all. It's pigmented. It's warm. Why is it warm? It wasn't even in the sun. Darkness, my old friend I've come to talk with you again Yeah, it's really sh emphasizing the mustache that I don't even have. I mean, this is why my mom thinks she has a mustache. She's going to continue all of her day. So I got my hair done. Box braids, as usual. Just smaller this time so they can last a bit longer. Do you like the finished look, you guys? I sure don't. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this rampage of a video. Um, it's not the best video in the world. This is kind of me <laughs> having like a mental breakdown mentally off camera and trying to figure out how to make a, like a decent look out of all of this. And this is really making me look like I have a dark mouth and what usually happens when I'm not wearing makeup and I put on a lipstick or a lip gloss it looks lighter like it looks like a white line so this is interesting how it's making me look like I have dark lines in my mustache <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you guys enjoy me using my mom's makeup because I always roast her on her makeup I'm about to roast her even more on her makeup I hope you guys have a lovely day. I'm going to take this off. Don't like this. <laughs> Hopefully we're not going anywhere today because I don't like seeing people anymore. I will see you guys in my next video.